Hey, hey, what's up, everybody? This is Andy, and you must really like hearing this intro because you guys keep coming back, and I appreciate it. We're doing some more Fresno State Coronavirus Dynasty. And I was, as I was just saying to the stream, which nobody's here yet, and that's fine. I, uh, I, so yeah, we're playing, we're playing Arizona State today. Could be similar to the Cal game. It's an A-plus team. We're on the road. Conference matchup. And I've been kind of mulling something over my mind. I feel like I should maybe try to run the ball more. However, at the beginning of the season, I stated a commitment to trying to pass the ball more and trying to push the ball downfield. And you guys will remember in this first game against Rutgers, it worked great. Uh, although, look at that. Rouse was the player of the game. But we threw for quite a bit. And then the following games didn't work as well. Boise, we only won by seven. These other these other games, we put up some points, but then we had a couple of closer ones. Seven-point win here, seven-point win there. Uh, and then we ended up losing. I, I would like to stick with my, my commitment to pass the ball, though, and try to pass efficiently, because it is difficult. The game against Cal, the big backbreaker was we couldn't get any pass protection, even on short routes. It just wasn't working. So that, that was pretty rough. So now we're going to play at Arizona State. Now, as far as passing, what would I do differently? I might want to throw, I might, might want to work in more screens. Potentially run PA read flow less because I, that running that inherently takes off about a second and a half of my pass protection, which is huge. It's a huge deal. That's when you, when you, when you get on average against a good D line, against a good D line, with your just main five blockers, even if you hold your running back in, you're looking at probably three seconds of protection on a good pass block down. That's if they don't have a great jump. If they have a great jump, you're looking at under two seconds most likely. So if you add in trying to run PA read flow or, you know, any play action, that's going to be a rough time. So not sure if we... Uh, that, that might be the adjustment, though, is to run more pass plays that are straight drop back without the play action. So if it comes to that today where I don't get the pass protection that I need, I think we'll probably go with that. And look at this. Arizona State, number one pass offense in the country. So let's do a little pre-scout on Arizona State. Oh, another big storyline. I think we saw this after... I think I stopped the video. I can't remember whether I stopped the video before we saw this or not. Boom. It is sanction time. Chris Carter... Ben Jacobs, my two-star linebackers, both got caught doing the dirty stuff. Rumor has it that Carter uses others to take exams for him. Rumor or not, we need to make a statement by suspending him for a few games. Or don't suspend him at all if uh, you don't have any points to use, which is the case for me. Jacobs. Jacobs has missed a few classes, and his GPA has dropped below the NCAA's accepted level. It is highly recommended that we take some disciplinary action before this escalates. Now this, I think, is funny because... If you don't have the GPA, you're straight up, the NCA won't let you. It doesn't matter if the, if the team disciplines you, the NCA will, will take you out. And, and I, I'm pretty sure it's the case that you would have to forfeit a game. So if it, I would think that if in real life, if your guy was ineligible GPA wise and you played, and, I, and as soon as that got out, I think you'd forfeit the game. So this is, that's kind of a funny one. So let's move on to our scout of Arizona State. And let's do depth chart view because that's the one that matters. All right. Roy Anderson, 99 overall, 80 speed. This could be a problem. What's his, what's his passing look like? Oh, my gosh. Rocket arm, and he can he can pit, thread the needle as well. Wow, is this? Rodney Glass, 95 overall, 94 speed. So kind of looking like a uh, little Robbie Rouse clone over here. Break tackle, carry. So that's not super high, but it's pretty good, over 80. And he's super fast, so this guy could be an issue. Fortunately, no dot. We'll just have to see. Oh, look at this. Oh, my gosh. Look at these receivers. This could be a long day today. Could be a very long day. 96 overall. They both have dot. They're both big. They're both strong. Well, this guy's not super strong. This guy is, though. 99 catch. Oh, my gosh. 92 carry. What about break tackle? This could be a long day, guys. This could be a very long day. I mean, they're, they're slot receivers in 88 with 95 speed. My goodness. 95 speed, 6'6". Six six. Where, where, where do you grow these kind of guys? What tree do I have to visit? Where's the orchard? 89 catch. Crazy. Look, at this guy's just nuts. Break tackle. He's got break tackle. He's got carry. Man, oh, man. Tight end. Uh, pretty high rated. Not super fast. High rated, though. O-line looking very good. Wow. Wow, this team is stacked. Defensive end. Look at all their defensive ends. 
You can't even get off the screen for less than 87 overall. Insane. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Defensive tackle stacked. Linebacker, fast and good. Fast and good. Fast and good. Super fast, super good. My God, my, these guys. This might be one of the most stacked teams we've ever seen. 88 speed, 91. Dude, they, there's no holes here. That, this is probably their biggest hole in defense. An 86 speed safety, 80 overall, which is pretty good overall. Hard hitter, 74 strength. 76 tackling, not that much on the tackling. So I, even though he's strong, I don't know how many fumbles he'd be forcing. Not really sure. No holes here, though. Ah, that's a great question, Coach Bob. That is an excellent question. Let's see who they... So they lost early in the season. I think they're on a, a win streak right now. Yeah, six-game win streak. So, team, how do we do this? Here we go. Arizona State, they lost to Arkansas, who is an A. They lost to uh, Wisconsin, who is an A+. Plus, and they lost to Cal, who is an A+. Plus. So their strength of loss is pretty good. I mean, in real life, you wouldn't... You wouldn't be... Like, they just got ranked, I think, last week. They would have been ranked far before that. I mean, in real life, you could be... You could be... Three and... You could be three and three and be ranked, like, number 19 with this schedule. Because they basically... Their gauntlet was at the beginning, if you if you look at it that way. Their gauntlet was up front. They beat USC. Now they're A-plus, beat them by seven. I mean, they've just been... They've been, they've been roasting peeps, so... <laughs> this This is going to be rough. Might potentially, potentially rough. So, yeah, let's get to it. Ah, uh, I don't know. It, it's, it's a, that's, I mean, it's a good play, but it's also kind of feast or famine. Yeah, we'll take action slash not really take action because we can't. We'll roll with it. Sanction City. Can you, what if you could, what if you could kick, kick a player off the team and it didn't cost points? I have no points. This is just, uh, my goodness. Yep, we're screwed. Oh, hold on, hold on. Here's the thing. Coach Bob, what do you think about this? Here, check this out. Check this out. So here's what I was wondering. I already had these guys commit. One, two, three, four, five, six. Should I, should I yank my uh, scholarship offer to these guys just to save a couple of scholarships for off-season recruiting because if I'm down to but I they haven't they haven't committed yet yeah I mean that's the only thing is it would free it up because if I get minus 10 I'm only gonna have 15 and after this I have nine if I get these two guys I'll have seven well it may not be because so here's a question so I, a question would be if I have fewer scholarships do I also have fewer recruiting points I don't know I don't know how that's gonna work because if that's the case, well, what the thing is, it's about how many guys can I recruit. But cutting them is cutting is after recruiting. So the question is, so don't preemptively cut them. But I, but I mean that. So cutting them when it's time to cut doesn't save a scholarship spot. So I've already got all these. Honestly, I think it's bad. I think it's bad because these guys are never, none of them are going to be that good, most likely. I'm only going to have seven scholarships to offer. Right, uh, nine at the moment. If I get these guys, at the end of the season, they'll tell you. And I, I'm pretty sure we're going to get hammered. It's most likely minus 10 scholarships, I think. Actually, we can look, I think. How do we do that? Okay. Oh, you know what? That's... No, no, no. That's not on here. It's on coach? Coach options? I thought there was somewhere you could see who has what? Who has the sanctions? Is it this? Oh, uh, wait a minute. Yeah, it'll be before. But uh, what I was saying is, if I if I pick these recruits up... So right now, if okay, assuming I have 15 scholarships because of the penalty, you usually get 25. Assuming I have 15, I've already signed six guys. That means I'm only going to be able to recruit nine guys. Here you go, one-year probation, but that doesn't say what it is. Okay, but my point is, do you understand my main point, though, is that 
I, I'm, I'm gonna if I recruit these two guys, it's two less guys I can go after during in-season recruiting. Do you do you understand that? So that's why I think that's a problem to recruit him, and why I'd rather not. Does that make sense? It doesn't. I, I know the points and stuff. I know off-season. So these count. These guys count toward my. So okay. So normally you get 25 scholarships per year to offer. These guys count toward that. So if I get minus 10, that means I instead of 25, I have 15. And since I've recruited six guys, six guys have committed. That means I would now have nine. If I get these two, it's seven. It does, but it means I'll get worse guys because, I mean, so the thing—the thing I don't know. Well, I'm going to put more in discipline already. Yeah, exactly. I'm for sure putting more. I might do like 40% discipline. I got to crank it up. So what I'm thinking is, so here, here's what I don't know is if the reduced, if the reduced scholarships means I don't get points. Oh, well, it does mean worse guys because these guys are guaranteed. Like these guys compared to an off-season recruit are worse. But, but, they, but they don't cost points to recruit, really. Uh, it's not going to cost me points. So what I don't know is, do the sanctions mean that I'll have less points for recruiting during off-season recruiting? If it does, then I'm better off just keeping these guys and using the remaining points to recruit better players. If I get the same number of points, I could just go to town on nine recruits and get actually probably some good players. So that I don't know. So I, I, that's where I disagree is that it, it does mean worse guys because these guys are worse than what I would get in off season. It is safer, yeah, it's true. And we'll just have a lower recruiting class. I mean, sanctions typically mean you have worse recruiting class. So I'm not against it. I just, I was just floating it out as something to think about. But it does mean that I can try to go after seven, you know, stronger guys, and I can use more points on scouting things like that. Discipline poor. I don't know about that, man. Howard Ross is going to get me back in the back in the clink. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, no, it's absolutely true. So, so this will this will this will be better overall, I think. I just I was it was just something I was thinking about. I wanted to see what you thought. So that's fine. So yeah, let's get to the game. Let's uh let's circle our wagons over to uh not Tucson. U of A's in Tucson, right? What town are these guys in? Tempe. Alright, let me switch my Oop, not picture mode. We'll do it after the after the intro. Welcome everyone. Brad Nestler here for EA Sports with my co-host Kirk Kirk Street and the coach Lee Corso. There's still a lot Their of warm air cool. out there for tonight's battle between the Fresno State Bulldogs and oh, yeah? the Arizona State Sun Devil. What were you doing out there? It's got to be exciting. Like internship or something? Everywhere. Yeah, is it pretty nice? It, it, I, I, those towns like that are pretty cool to me, like Las Vegas. Yeah, like Phoenix. They're just kind of these big cities out in the middle of nowhere. I can imagine. The Berm 87. What's up, sir? I'm getting the keys to my house today. My wife and I. How about that? I was talking to Scott about it earlier, actually. Coach Bob, can this uh, can this be can that be the screenshot? Can that be the thumbnail with you saying the coeds are nice? That sounds appropriate. Yeah. Hmm. I guess I'll kick it. I don't like it, but that does seem to be the way to go. <laughs> All right, let's switch my input over now. There we go. That was pretty cool. Wow, so a job transfer just for the summer. So is that uh, was that your your current job? That's pretty cool. Either way. Well, 
from his own end zone. Did you guys see the pre-scout that I did? They're stacked. This team is crazy stacked. Arizona State. Check them out. 99 overall quarterback, 80 speed. He has 99 arm and 91 accuracy. Running back, 95 with 94 speed. Excuse me, speed back, so a little bit. Not not as bad as a power back. Look at their receivers. Dot receiver, 290, a 95 and a 96. Then their slot has 95 speed, 96 foot 6. Tight end's good. O-line is stacked. Defensive ends are all stacked. D-tackle stacked. Linebackers are stacked. Their worst player by far is a strong safety who still has 86 speed. And 70 awareness. That's plenty. So it's going to be it's gonna be a long day. Or a short day. We might get ran off the court. They might. This might be the first mercy roll. No, it's okay. It's not going to happen. We'll do 3-3-5 three, three, split. Cover three. Let's see. What's going on? Okay, my controller's being wonky. Might have to, like, reconnect it or something. Okay, we're there. Oh, no, we're not. Darn it. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Well, I like those towns in the middle of the desert, man. Vegas, Phoenix, stuff like that. Uh, like Denver. I mean, Denver's kind of in, you know, it's kind of in the plains type area. Stuff like that's pretty cool. Well, that's, uh, goodness, I don't know what to do here. I guess we'll go cover three. The QB, did he move? I didn't. I was kind of focused on my rush. Does he run a little bit? I mean, that's... I don't know about the QB speed. The receiver got upfield, though. And actually, the dot man is slower. He's only got, like, 87 speed. It's their slot guy that's a burner. Okay, we'll play, we'll play Ben Jacobs here. Yes! Ben Jacobs, get on that! Oh, we needed that. We needed that. Square up, strip, profit. That's how we go. That is how we get down. Look at this. Square up. Boom. Look at this. It's just a quick little casual. Bloop. Just reach in there. And Skinner. Skinner picking it up. It has to be. Now, didn't I thought he actually did set a record, or was it a team record? He set some kind of record, I'm pretty sure, already. I forget what it was, though. God, we need that. Okay, we'll run it to the right. I don't know how well this is going to go, but... There uh, we go. Ooh, a little off tackle action. Switch ball hand. Oh, look at that. Yeah, he okay. Oh, INTs. There you go. Yep, I forgot. All right, let's uh, let's get let's start. Let's give it a shot here. Pay read flow. So as I discussed before, I'm not going to do strong slots on this anymore by default, because I would like to try to actually pass the ball to the wide guy at some point. Is this man or zone? This appears to be zone. This could be a. This should be good for a handoff actually. Nice. Yeah, that hole. I can't not go through a hole like that. I could have ran left, but I like to take the hole. I got to reward my offensive linemen. They make a hole. I gotta. I gotta accept. Let's see. Let's give this a try. Slant outs. This looks like man. Oh man, if I have a. Uh, if I had a. Uh, snap it. Oh man, that, they're off sides, right? I, 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 that was bad. I don't like that, even though they're off sides. I don't want to take a sack like that. And I'll tell you what I did that I don't care for is I had my eyes on Bennett, and I looked at him for too long. What is this? He just doesn't even block him. We have three guys over here blocking. What is that, man? Like, and I've seen this before. You'll see guys slide over when they think someone else has the block. So a lot, a lot of times, if you can visually imagine, say there's another lineman, another rusher right here. Sometimes they'll slide over like that to guard the other guy. Although it kind of looks like he's going for this guy, number 32. So he must have thought the center was going to slide over. Because you will see that, and they'll do it well. They'll do a good job. Right there, is just, that was a dumpster fire right there. Yep. This guy has to learn to watch the ball and not listen to let's the run. Let's run inside hook. So this looks like man. So we should get Leonard coming in here. Leonard, if they blitz, will probably go Dudley. Arizona State brings in the nickel here. Nope, nobody's open. Nope, 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 nope. Yeah, this guy covered both, this uh, middle zone. 
erase both Dudley and Leonard. I had really nothing. Even this is dicey. This guy can warp over and pick that even if I bullet it. So there was nothing going there. And that's fine. That's how it goes sometimes. I'm going to go with this P. Reed. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 23. Kind of hard to tell if it's man or zone, though. And I'll tell you what, too. Okay, this looks like man. I'll tell you what, though. I was watching Coach Al, one of Coach Al's games. He's been playing 07. And, uh... Oh, no, that's... No, no. Okay, I'm very lucky. I, I was... I always forget to look at this corner. I got I got super lucky. Plus, I thought it was going to be man, so that kind of threw me off, too. Uh, I was watching one of Coach, Al, Coach Al's uh, 07 videos, and he was actually mistaken on man or zone in a couple of times. So I'm like, okay, thank you. That's some... Uh, I feel a little bit vindicated because I've been having major issues. Let's try this receiver under. It's kind of a double post. Yeah, it probably was. Yeah. I think I was too honed in on the pass coverage, and so I just kind of, in my mind, I was doing pass. Oh, no. I didn't realize I was running out of time. Okay, well, here's something I would like to, that I'll probably employ. I, I'm going to go kind of conservative on this. Um, I think I'm actually going to do PA read flow here. I have full momentum. And I don't want to turn it over. Yeah, I, I'd actually be okay to uh, just get the field goal here. I really don't want to turn it over. Wow, they really went for it. Oh, no. Wow, look at that leap. So I, as soon as I said I didn't want to turn it over, not a great pass. He doesn't lead him at all. Look at this guy. Just sky up. I, I'll never get even a receiver to get an animation that good. But yeah, not a well-thrown ball. Also, the position is not really there. Like, here the position is there, but as he continues, it's just not there. So I'm thinking I just can't throw. I, yeah, it was. It was absolutely perfect. I can't. I can't. That I, That's second time I should have been picked in the same drive. So I'm going to accept the house money on that and just not throw to that guy anymore. And the first one, it was an issue of matchup. That one was, though. He gets it up. So we'll take that. And it's good. Not a bad kick to get your team three points, Kirk. Yeah, he so, good not a bad start. Got momentum. Got, got a lead. Right I won't complain. Fresno State, ready to kick this one off. The stadium's rocking. And Maxwell, back ready to return. Sends it sailing downfield. Maxwell fields it in the end zone. I'm sure the defense will be trying to strip the ball once again. And if these kids don't start Could be. Uh, maybe. But, I mean, the guy's a dot. And he's fa I think he's fairly fast. You're talking about his mat. Like, if he can beat this guy one-on-one. -on -one, is that what you're asking? He's big. He can jump. Oh, okay. Like, throw it over the, over the head. Yeah, so you're saying, like... If he's running, like if the ball, like if he's running the ball and they're kind of here, throw it like out here and let him kind of run under it. That, so a precision pass doesn't really guarantee where the ball is going to go. I mean, I could, I could precision pass any direction I want. I really don't have exact control over where the car's going to put it. So I can't just pass it anywhere. I mean, I, I just don't, I don't know how that would work. I'd have to practice that and see if precision, if that, if the precision pass would put the ball there. Cause I really have no idea. All right, let's do let's do cover three zone. Let's see who's who's doing what. Emmanuel back here. They'll throw on first down. Over there. Oh, look at that man! The guy, why, guy went for the pick. Yikes. Hmm. That was Edwards that missed the pick. So it's kind of nice so far that. Uh, what is going on here? This is weird, man. This is really weird. There's something going on with my formation subs. And for some reason, I don't, I'm not getting Carter in on defense. Uh, on nickel. Wait, defense. Nickel. Let's get Carter in here. Because I, oh, okay, you know what? I changed these last game, and I didn't think stuff you did in the game would have, would save, but apparently it did. And we'll, gonna, we'll get Carter in there as well. I mean, all due respect to Skinner, he's a playmaker, but 
Yeah. Okay, what do we have? I've been like, running out of time. This is the third time already. Oh, I'm okay. I don't want to run that. Screw that. Okay, we're looking okay. Oh, I didn't know there was a guy there. Strips. Is that a delay? Oh, it just took him forever. Look at 33. It just takes him the eternity to get out of the backfield. He gets kind of gets kind of pushed around. What did you see there, guys? The defense was in zone. Yeah. The offense did a good but job they still ran six guys on pass routes. Nice ball to get the first down. And the receiver ran a nice route to get off between the zone coverage. It's first and zone blitz here. Our man Slade, our main blitzer man. Okay, let's play manual deep. Yes, there we go. Skinner. He's like, hey, you're going to take me out of those nickel packages. I got to make an impact on a, on a 335 split. Second and 17. Whoa, we'll manual deep again. I don't trust my guys deep right now. Oh, no, come on. Come on. Gosh darn it. Oh, no. Okay, okay, we got lucky. I wanted to control this guy, man. That's annoying. My controller was tripping out or something. So he kind of boxed him out. And he did a bad animation. That's not a good animation at all. This kind of turn that the Arizona State guy does. Yeah, it's it's pretty clutch. Really, uh, Jay Nickel, that just, uh, I guess maybe like 20 minutes now. Let's see here. What do I want to do? Third and 17. I think I'll actually go dime, cover two, man. And then I'll, I'll manual Jacobs and just kind of hope that the running back doesn't run a route and that I can kind of play back in his own because I want to rush my four still. Okay, here we go. Oh, look at that. He didn't made it easy for me. Made it easy. Here we go. We got a chance here. Dot man cometh. That's a corner though. Oh man, try to spin it. Yeah. The Twitch notifications are not very consistent. A lot sometimes I won't get them at all. Let's go. Okay, we want to go Robbie keeper or like Robbie. Yeah, we'll do this. Robbie right, keeper left. Let's see if they shift. They shift that way. Okay, so we'll keep with Robbie. So it, now it's a question of how well does that right linebacker strafe Robbie. Ooh, look at that. Very well. Man, okay, sorry. There's like there's like a hair or something on my glasses. It keeps getting in my vision. I don't care for it. Or I could be imagining it. Could be imaginary. Okay, here we go. From QB slot. Stacking the box now. Shifting, shifting. No shift. So let's see how this works. I'm not going to shift my line because I think it's thrown off. We'll experiment, though. Yes, very nice. Oh, look at that. Big hit. Wow, lay in the wood. Oh, it's a reflection on my, on my mouthpiece, my uh, headset. Okay. Mystery solved, guys. Don't worry. Okay, let's go with P. Reed. Looks like zone. Which is good to run against, but they have two guys on the edge. They have two stand-up linebackers over there. We'll just have to read what they do. If they come in, I'm going to have to keep it. And probably, I'll pro you know what? I'm going to probably go swing pass somewhere else if they blitz. Okay, they kind of... Man, this... Ah, I don't like that. Big hit, Wentworth, who was the whipping boy against uh, against Cal. Second and seventeen. I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with Max Protect right now. In fact, and long. And long. this is man. So this is rough because they have a dot man wide side, which is where I normally want to go. So here I'm gonna let Hayden run and hope they blitz and I can hit Hayden. Otherwise, I might be forcing it into Bennett. Okay, actually it's Leonard. So I thought they were gonna be in man. We got like five yards. That's not too bad. Third and 14. That was a sensational effort by the defense. So here I want to go with the deep in. Where is it? Halfback out. So this is a bit tough because it couldn't mean Wiley. So actually, if it's man, I'm going to want to hit. Uh, I'm going to want to hit Leonard. 
depending on the safety, what the safety does. So we'll just have to read this and hope we get some time to throw. Nope. I don't want to throw at that dot. I'm sorry. I really didn't want to throw at the dot. I know he looks super open, but I just I have no idea what's going to happen. Is he going to sprint up and pick it? I think it's highly likely. And I don't want to give up my momentum. So you guys probably didn't like that one, but to me that's something I have to all I'll live with. I'll, I'd rather punt than risk that. Because I had momentum. If they already had momentum, I say game on. Mm, not the best punt. They've been going out of bounds. Like I, I didn't, I didn't think the angle was that bad, but clearly it was. Okay, let's run some more blitzes. It's busting up their play action pretty well. We'll play, uh, we'll play corner deep. Nice run out. No, no. Okay. I was starting to get afraid because there were a bunch of guys there, but when he hurtled, I, that always makes my heart jump a bit. Strong safety zone. We'll do that one. We've got to risk it a bit more here. Nice. All right. Third and six, third and seven. Yep. Let's go regular nickel here. And we'll go cover three. Third and seven. So what do we want? We'll let uh we'll let Carter patrol the skies over there. Actually, I'll manual this guy right here. This this might be coming my way. I would not be surprised. Okay. Oh, get there. Yes. Let's go. Hold on. Yeah. Edwards. He dropped that pick earlier. He's like, I'm not dropping that one. Kind of a duck here into coverage. What's going on? Oh, off the back foot. Pressured. And what, we, what do we know about Heisman cor CPU quarterbacks? They hate taking a sack. They would rather throw it right to the D. Yeah, they'd rather throw it right to the D than take a sack. So we'll take that. Okay, let's do... This is a tough one. I'm going to go with this receiver middle. Okay. They appear to be in man. I kind of want to wait for Bennett to get open and try to zip one into Bennett. If they really blitz, we could go Leonard. Okay, they're coming. They're coming. So we'll go there. Got a few yards. I wanted to wait on Bennett, but I saw this guy patrolling the skies in the mid. So, and th this actually worked better than I thought, and I threw it pretty soon after the break. I think sometimes I wait too long. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. Let's uh, let's run some some run play here. Actually, let's do this. I know I just had a run. I want to run a run, but let's do this. I actually want to pass out a kind of run formation, just keep things balanced. Bennett coming across. If they blitz, I can hit Bennett. Otherwise, maybe Lawrence on the swing out. Or, oh, goodness. Yeah, I didn't want to take a big hit there. Max coverage. Just took, took what we could get. Okay, this situation, I really don't want to run here. But you know what I'll do? Here, I think I, sh I actually should run Old Faithful. Because we can read a linebacker here and possibly run it. So this is actually pretty nice. This this is a pretty nice setup because we can read that left linebacker. Well, now there's two guys over there. We can read them, see what they do. They actually fade it back. Nice. Look at that. That's like eight yards. That's beautiful, man. Yeah, I think getting Robbie more carries is going to help. Uh, I kind of discussed that a bit that... I wanted to, I, I, my, my objective for the season was to try to rely more on the pass because Carr is a dot. You can get run blocking now. Oh, I tried to spin. That's all right. This is looking like the way to go. So I'm going to call here, flanker screen, and then look to audible. Ooh, 5-2 against a screen pass. Ooh, okay. This looks good for Bennett. Even with that shift. Uh, okay, we got the first, though. I guess maybe lucky that we didn't bat it down or get a pick. Yeah, he actually went for the pick there. You can see him reach for the animation, but Hayden boxes him out. Got a little lucky there, because he made a great break on the ball. It isn't much, Brad, 
but it does give them a new set of downs. Halfback tight end combo. I actually like this. So this will be what Jensen running out. Yeah, Jensen Rouse combo. Wiley Bennett. So I'm really going to be looking at this Rouse Jensen combo here. Actually, let's just go for it. Big and tall. Let's go. That's nice. See, that Rouse wasn't open. In fact, the guy runs her out for him on Rouse. I guess I got kind of lucky. Uh, well, you know, this corner. So one thing about this corner route is you usually get this positioning, especially from a tight end. You typically get that, so I don't have to worry too much. But another thought I had is, you know, maybe this post, but look at the coverage on this post. It's perfect. And fellas, this is really so that would never be open. Drive. Three first downs and counting on this drive, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building some momentum here. I'm going to go P. Reed but out of this formation right here. This defense on the field. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics brought to you by Coke. Looks like man. I'm, okay, thank goodness. That, with all that heat, that was looking a little, a little, uh, a little bit iffy. Three-yard line. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, they got to move these guys around. Wow, they're they're really stacking the box now. What if I move him over? I don't know. Yeah, I'll just I'll, I'll try Robbie up the gut here. Oh no! I tried to hand it off, it actually didn't do it. I must not have done it quickly enough. And the helmet was detached. Well, let's go old faithful. Look at that. Not only 92%? That's not acceptable. That's not enough. This offense knows how to close the deal and put points on the scoreboard. So I, I think I'm going to try to stay in the pocket here. Nope. Oh! Now here, I'm kind of looking like if I can just hold on to the ball longer, I could hit Leonard. But then when I get, get to where he actually could throw it to him, I just I don't want to throw on the run like that. Looks like Robbie got loose. No, he actually didn't. Yeah, no, I thought so too. So he got back. I think his, his hand looks offside. No, no, not quite. If you look at it dead on, his hand may not be offsides. That's fine. Third and goal from the two. Let's go with like a bigger set here. Oh, you know, it could be good as a tunnel screen, actually. Do I have that here? Yeah. Okay, this looks like zone. Oh, goodness. This is kind of dicey because I don't want to throw it. At, Wiley's basically not an option. It's fine, though. Well, let's go to Rouse, basically. Oh, no, not quite. Hmm. Uh, Wiley kind of came open, actually. I didn't really look at him, though. I mean, I wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna throw it into. I wasn't gonna try to split defenders with a pass. That was never an option. Yeah, nothing quite worked out. Yeah, it's true. I mean, did, so did he not really get a favorable? Yeah, the turn. I mean, and I just couldn't get. You know what? Too. This is probably a failure by me. If I just stiff arm, there's a chance I get a fall forward. But instead, I go for the spin. That probably wasn't a great call. Oh, darn it. Okay, still good. Uh, did they get close to blocking that? Okay, no, not. Well, okay, actually, I, my own guy got close to blocking it. What are you doing, Wilson? What is that? Oh, he gets shoved back and he kind of does a recoil animation. Oh, I'm getting a phone call, guys. One sec.
as I'm back. Sorry about that. All right. That's all under control. Buying a house, people call you. It's sort of, sort of crap. Because I don't like having to answer numbers that I don't recognize. All right. Ooh, the crowd quieted down. Fresno State the kick. Lined up with a kick I guess when you pause, everybody goes to the goes to get a hot dog or go to the bathroom, huh? He really got a hold of that kick. I mean, we get the keys today, so I guess technically it'll start today. But I think we'll start with uh, packing. We haven't really done any packing yet. And we have a month to move out, so uh, so there's really not a big rush. Let's go here. Uh, we'll go OB double spy. Their QB runs. I don't know if I necessarily want. So who's that, Skinner? Let's actually rush Carter. We'll man up here. The Sun Devil. Line up in an eye formation. Gives it off. Here we go. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Coach Bob. We're excited. My main concern is how does this affect my ability to stream the coronavirus dynasty? Oh, yes! He felt heat. What is this about? That's so bizarre. Nobody's even close. Who's he throwing to? I guess he's throwing to this guy? Uh, that's a good question. I need to call up the I need to call up the cable company and get internet hooked up over there. Yeah, well, I know, right? Shopping, yeah. So we'll we'll get like new furniture. Uh, let's see. Actually, I want to do this. Where's the uh, Where's this one right here? Double T E outs. Yeah, we no, we've already bought some stuff. I think our bed is being shipped. Stuff like that. All right, here we go. We got to concentrate. Let's concentrate, guys. We're gonna want to go to Bennett here instead of Wiley, probably. Actually, Hayden. Yeah, nobody's open. Ah, darn it. We'll get rid of it. Okay, I got the flag, though. So that was a weird one. I, it was man, but with that safety deep, I really didn't want to throw the cor the the corner posts. But then there's a little window, like, right as I'm running, I see Bennett. I'm like, oh, man, I don't think I can get it there. I don't think I can thread this reliably. And then time more time went by. I could have maybe tried to throw it to Hayden, but I, I've got full momentum. I really, really don't want to turn it over. Let's go double running back option. Let's see what we can figure out. Yeah, he did. I, I agree, Coach Bob. Yeah, so we bought a bed. The bed is on the way, I guess. Uh, wow, they shifted both linebackers one way and line another. So let's actually, we'll fan right. We'll actually go right here. Get that guy cleared out a bit. Oh, no. No blocking here on the D end. That's, I tried to fan him right, too. It just didn't work out. Kudos to, is that Wilson? Trying to, yeah, trying to, trying to plug the dike there, but didn't, couldn't quite do it. Second down. Might try running again, actually. Period. Let's do this option choice. Okay, here, this could be a potential keeper for Carr. So now this is a classic, this is a classic option read. I'm going to read that right defensive end and see, kind of see what he does. He actually goes for the... Oh, no. Oh, I tried... That's bullcrap, man. I, I tried to stiff arm. It basically said, no, you will not stiff arm. You will get torpedoed in the throwing shoulder. Goodness. That's an illegal hit nowadays, too, man. I have no idea. Do I want to know? I, <laughs> he's going to block the safety downfield. He's looking for that fourth level block. Hayden's thinking touchdown, man. He's, he's dreaming big. He's dreaming real big. Look at that. He's about to seal him off for the touchdown. He just forgot step one and two and three, which is get past the front line. So third and nine. That's true. So Pia Reed is not really going that great. What do we else do we have in here? Like maybe Mesh. Mesh actually looks pretty good. Uh, yeah, let's go Mesh. Okay, they're corners on the slot. This is actually great. This is great, great, great news. We're going to block Robbie. Oh, no. Okay, here we go. Here we go. If it's a man, we could go Wiley or Bennett here. So let's see what we got. Actually, I want to go Bennett. Yeah. No, oh, he dropped it. Oh, good throw. He, he's a very good throw. And look, two here. Wiley does not have good positioning on this on this corner. So 
it was a good read to not throw. I mean, I, I honestly didn't look at Wiley, so I didn't look at Wiley and go, oh, I shouldn't throw it there. I saw Bennett coming open. I'm like, oh, that's a good one. It's too bad. Dudley, yeah, but he's going to get probably hit and fumble because of this dot man. I don't think Dudley gets the first down there, honest to goodness. I don't think it happens. Because also, look how he turns up field. Yeah, I mean, he gets picked. It's just, that's, he's open, but he's getting chased by that guy. Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, he's probably pretty good. I like, I still like the Bennett read better, though. I was, but dude, it's a dot. It's a dot, and that guy's been destroying people. I still, I like, I still like the Bennett read better. That's just my personal, personal taste, though. Oh, not good. I missed that. Man. Oh, they got momentum for that, too? Shoot. Man, that's too bad. I just, I did, yeah. I, oh, you can't look at the uh, your accuracy on the on the clip. But I put the stick a little bit to the left. It just didn't pick up. So you could easily interpret that as saying I did not push the stick to the left. So let's see if we can hold on before half. This really changes, really, the complexion of the game quite a bit. There, oh, okay, good, good, good. I was, I was afraid that get tipped. So our defense is still playing pretty well. Let's, let's keep the heat on here with a little bit of blitz. And, and plus two, I'm just, I'm gonna always favor throwing it for a first. You know, throwing it behind the sticks and hoping for a run. I'm more apt to do that against worse defenses. There we go. That blitz was coming pretty hard that time, Kirk. Too wide, so let's do this. I'm going to blitz Carter, and I'm going to try to run. I'm going to try to rush the pass for myself. Who do we got? Who's got somewhat of a match here? LRB, we'll go with Johnson. Boom. Yes. No. Okay, okay, okay. Tackle him. Good, good, good. That's that's pretty much what I wanted. I wanted to force a quick throw and just hope that they couldn't quite get it to the sticks. And I was able to get the great jump here, which is really nice. Boom, set him down. But I knew, too, for that to be more effective, I knew I'd have to rush one other guy because the CPU O-lines are way too good at shifting over to compensate for the great uh, for the big hit. So this will be good. I really hope that I hope I can get momentum back before half. Um, and even if I can't, it'll get it'll get, you know, cut in half. Uh, no, that's that's there's nothing going on there. Yeah, I mean, I when I saw Wiley in the covers that he was under, I just I immediately moved my vision to the other side of the field. And then I saw that their uh, their middle coverage was not going to cover Bennett most likely. I actually might want to. I don't know. I might keep this with Carr. Uh, you know what? That's a bit. There we go. We got a few. Yeah, so to the right, did not have very much potential. Oh, you know, I forgot about mantle counters. That's a great thought. I might have to start doing that again. Drag special. This actually looks pretty good. Yeah, get a few yards. But yeah, mantle counter would have been better because this is wide open over here. And these guys aren't reacting very well. I mean, he's a dot. He's starting to come up. So uh, yardage probably would have been about the same, but it's I'd much rather have Rouse carrying it than Carr. Oh, goodness. No, no, no. Ah. I guess that was a great jump, huh? So, let's see. Third and 17. I guess I'll just I'll try to get the first here. Not really sure how I'll do that. Cross post. That looks as good as anything. So, let's run this cross post and hope that their dot man stays on Wiley. He does. Okay, they sent the dot out to Wiley. So, that's that's good there. Uh, let's Let's block Robbie. We should be able to get him on here after another try, or not. We'll just let it go. I mean, this this play doesn't have a great chance of working anyways. Goodness. Uh, I tried to just get it to Hayden there. Hmm. Yeah, we actually had some possibility down here. If I could get it off, like if I had a little more time to throw, I could try to get it deep. I mean, I got two deep guys, one covering, so. So how did that, how'd that go? Just knocked him back. Yeah, that's too bad. Well, the defense gets all there. Well, the defense did what they had to do to get three and out and now get the offense back on the field. I think we have a celebration coming. Is that what we're waiting for? Yep. Nope. Hayden. So he's looking at Hayden like he dropped it. That's funny. He must have touched it. Did he touch the ball? He had to have to get the animation. No? 
Strange. Maybe because it was touched at all? I don't know. See, this is this would be a fun time for the fake, man. This would be a real fun time for the fake. What do you guys think? See, here's there's a couple reasons I'd be okay with going for it for the fake here. They already have momentum and punting it. Yeah, I know. I, I would want to. It just it sounds so much fun, though, especially if it worked. Because uh, I feel like just the pot odds. So say so say if I had uh, like if I had if I had more of a lead in momentum, I would never do it. But they already have momentum. I'm in my own end zone. I think the, I think the odds are kind of there for it, but yeah, not really a great choice. I'm actually just going to kick this normal and let my gunners get down there. He gets it away. Nice kick, Ball actually. I mean, considering the situation, he was in the zone too, so to force a fair catch is really, really clutch. Let's go nickel cover three. They're probably going to be passing it. Yeah, no, I wanted to the berm, but that's my conscious couldn't quite do it. Pretty close though. Honestly, pretty close. Playing with Donald Sheet up here. Give me that. Oh, no, I overran it. That might be a touchdown. Did I really? How? What happened here? I guess I just overran it. Well, and I don't get an animation. That's some garbage. I sh here, I should get an animation that takes me toward the ball. I get no animation. That's crap. I'm a little upset about that. Like, why would I not get an animation? I get a bunny hop. I knew I was there. I knew I was in good position. He just came up with his 60th I knew I was. Okay, the they hardly got any momentum for that. That's strange. I guess. I guess. Wow, decked. Oh, Carter almost got there. Oh, goodness. Wait, did we get a message from John in Discord? What was it? Okay, they only have partial momentum. I might be inclined to run this out. With green, we'll run it out. Oh, we have to. We're on the one. Let's go green. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Oh, we almost hit the hole there. Green gets me excited. Uh, yeah, I basically should have since I gave up a touchdown immediately. Let's uh let's run this P read. Here's the offensive production statistics. So this is one I don't mind running against a good pass rush. Wow, 69 yards of offense. That's so bad. I don't mind running this against pressure, against high lot of defense pressure, because I can go to Leonard pretty quickly. He steps up. Wow, sacked again. So was, yeah, so I guess that wasn't the best choice, but it's only minus a few. Minus six. We'll live. Let's actually I kinda want to go back to a run. Spread out. Pinch in. This looks like, okay, this could be a manual counter. So I'm going to go ahead and hand it to Robbie, and I'm going to read that left linebacker for manual counter. Oh, goodness. Okay, I actually got some room here. <gasps> Catch a block. Okay, we couldn't quite we couldn't quite get the, uh, the block we wanted there, and that's okay. So what do we want to do here? Actually, I'm going to run. I'm going to run. Uh, I want to run split and drag. No, not that one. I want to run this one. Where is it? Split and drag, yeah. And Robbie running up the right side. We'll look for Bennett. We'll also look for Rouse. If they blitz, I should be able to just hit Bennett here. Okay, they don't. Okay, let's hit Robbie. Don't drop it. Okay, good, good, good. Let's see, do I have timeouts? All uh, yeah, let's turn hurry up and see when they set the ball down. Donde stall the ball. Okay, we're good. We don't need to. Actually, let's go Leonard. Curl me. Yes. Look at that. We're gonna hurry up again. I'm kind of feeling probably a, a timeout here though. No. Okay. We'll go Robbie here. Okay, that's good. The pass good for maybe seven yards. Let's go halfback sub. We'll set Robbie out for a play here. Let's go with this double cross, actually. Now, this is really good. If it's man, I could hit Leonard. If it's zone, probably looking for Dudley. Actually, I might even hit Lawrence if it's zone. We'll just see here. Leonard could get loose here, though, if it's man. Oh, no. Goodness. Oh, get rid of it. Damn it. No. 
I was trying to get rid of it, man. Son of a gun. Where are these guys coming from on the pass rush? Why And why the hell does he need to turn around to throw it away? I swear I was not throwing it to Robbie. I, I'm dead serious. This I'm hitting White to throw it away. Why does he have to turn around like that? If I knew he had to turn around like that, I wouldn't have thrown it. Dude, that is rough, man. That is so rough. And their their little zone blitz thing just confuses my guys because I have I have enough blockers, but then my left tackles out there just doing nothing. Why would he turn like that? Why can't why can't he just why can't he just throw it out here and not not turn not do a 360? Wowzers, man! Rough end of the half. Kind of all started with my missed field goal though. That's my fault. At least we get the ball to start the second half. Almost blocked that. I mean, maybe we need to look in some, into some screens. So we have six seconds. We'll try to see. We'll see what we can make happen here. Plenty of distance. That means end zone. Good with me. So actually, I'm thinking we could run play action. Let's put in. Uh, let's put in. Let's. Where is he at? Where's Smith at? Let's put Smith at number two receiver. Let's run like play action here. PA read. We got Smith back there. They already have full momentum, so this doesn't matter. We'll block Hayden. Here we go. This actually has a chance here. Nope, too far. Here. Rough one. The the hey, they're an A plus. They're on a roll. This is a good team. This is a good team playing well, and we're in their house. Okay, let's get uh, let's get. Line. Oh, actually, it's Bennett. Bennett's usually number two. How's Dehar doing? Does he have minus anything? Minus one accuracy. Not bad. What do our stats look like? Eighteen rushes. I mean, how many times have we given it to Robbie? Eight times. I mean, fourteen passes, eight runs. Yeah, what's what does what the run average look like? We probably should be running it more. 7.8 per run, yeah. So let's try to run it more. I, I need to run it at least twice out of the next three plays. So we'll run on first down. We'll let that go. It's temp more tempting when it's to the side, but we'll let it go. So let's have a look at uh, – let's do this. This has actually been working pretty well. We don't want – oh, a sub, though, just regular. Okay, PA read flow. And let's concentrate on a read and try to get it to Robbie. Okay, this looks excellent now. I'm actually not going to – I'm going to cheese it. Normally I bring the uh, receiver up in the slot, but I'm not going to do that. Okay, there we go. Very nice. Oh, let's get out of bounds. Chip away. And let's go double, uh, double running back. Let's do it out of here. I do want to go double running back. Here's a look at the offensive production. Okay, another good alignment. Stacking the box. And also it gives me the opportunity to go Rouse. Fresno State lines up in a shotgun set. Yes. We're gonna outrun. We don't we don't want to pitch if we don't have to. On defense, it's all about instincts. Robbie's making it happen. Okay, let's run this. This could be a keeper in which I toss it out to Robbie on a swing. We'll also read, okay, they shift in. So we're going to read this left linebacker. However, there's a great chance. I'm most likely going to keep it. Unless he runs to the right, there's a good chance he can mirror Robbie really well. Yeah, let's see. Uh, actually, going to run with it myself. Oh, no. Okay, good, good, good. We'll run double option. We'll run it the other way. So Robbie is the uh, the option give. Yeah, this is a keeper. This looks like a potential keeper since they're in man. There's nobody covering left. So the question is, can Hayden block that guy that's directly in front of him? I would kind of hope so. So we'll run this thing. Oh, goodness. I pitched it, man. Pitched the ball. Look at this. There's nobody out here. If he can get this pitch off, Lawrence is running for days. Ah, oh, man. That's that's one of the more frustrating things about this game. And now it's third down and long. 
one of the more frustrating things is how uh, is how you make good reads like that, and then the, def the the computer just says, "No, you did not." They say fake news. So let's go with this half back out. So we're going to be what, looking at what Leonard running a sh kind of a skinny uh, corner, and then Bennett coming in. So let's block Robbie. No, uh, yeah, block Robbie. So let's hope we get some blocking here. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Well, curl, curl me, curl me, curl me. Yes. Oh no, he dropped it. Of course. Shades of uh, Cal over here, wide open. So I also, I also thought about going to Bennett, but I just the way I was over here, if I was in the pocket, then maybe. But that's still pretty dicey. These guys could easily jump. More likely this this guy. So I had a good read there. We had a nice little rocket jump. We had a nice little curl. Just couldn't hold on. We will punt. Okay, let's try to cough and corner. I mean, corner it. Uh, I'll go regular. Our coverage is pretty good. If we actually could get it to the goal line, I would corner it. Oh, look at that. Look at that boot. Okay, let's go over here just to spread out our coverage a bit. There we go. Come on, get him. Okay, so now we've got a chance to get a stop. Keep in mind, we haven't given up really like a free touchdown to them. Except, I mean, on, on defense, I should say. Uh, let's go with a little blitz here. Middle slant three. We want to keep putting pressure. Two, two dot guys. That's got to be the corner out there. Oh, man. I, yeah, we'll see. If it doesn't pop up after next play, then we'll see what that is. I actually didn't know the injury. I was too focused on getting the next play. We'll lose on blitz. My gosh, that's bad. Torn quad. Torn quad sounds like you'd be out for like a year or two, honestly. That <laughs> sounds so terrible. Oh my gosh. Now we got to replace. So we got Skinner. We have a lot of depth at linebacker, fortunately, but that still hurts. Nice. We needed that. Goodness. I know, right? That's what I was kind of wondering. I was kind of wondering. I was wondering if, like, we just, without discipline points, could you just, like, suspend someone for the season? Oh. Man, when I manual rush. Oh, look at this. Johnson. Johnson gets in without uh, getting blocked. Yeah, you know. Yeah, exactly. Third and ten. Oh, goodness. I don't know what to do here. Okay, I'm going to go. I actually want to keep pressure on. No, I didn't mean to do that. Dang it. Uh, definitely don't want to run cover two. We'll run this, I guess. I didn't want to run this. Old manual. Oh, he's taking off. Get him. Yes. Wow, that went none of the ways that I wanted it to. Johnson hurt. And why wasn't Malik out here? Or why wasn't Marquise out here? Oh, yeah, dude, where's, where's Tito at? That's a strange one. I don't understand that. Th thankfully, we got the ball back. Won't be too upset. Oh, yeah. Let's cook something up, Green. Okay, we got a little chance here. Oh, no, that was a little I truly really tried to get back and block this guy. How close was I? Ah, he's just too fast. So that's a receiver, so I think he's one of the 87 speed guys. Fan the line. Nothing there. The defensive end was mm. the victor on that play as he bolted in to tackle him for a loss. And he was able to do that because the interior line... And as the season goes on, it's kind of confirming what I thought would be really rough, which is... I didn't mean... What did I just call it? I didn't mean to call that. What the hell is that? Oh, that's, is that QB slot? We'll roll with that. That passing efficiently on Heisman is almost an impossible task. It's so hard. Okay, we got... Oh, goodness. Okay. Wow, couldn't even get a fall forward. We just get torpedoed. They don't even have full momentum. Let's check out receiver middle. Yeah, we'll run this. So one thing we might do here is we might run Leonard on a real uh, actual out. Yeah, 
the skid him. There we go. So it's looking for Bennett, probably or Leonard. Early jumps, that's good. Okay, we had. Yeah, really have a good chance there. And pass rush is about to hit me. So I could have gone Wiley, but this guy could could warp over and pick it. So and he's also got the dot on him. But really, if I could go back and redo that, I would try. I would just try to laser in Wiley. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Uh, we're, it's going to come to that pretty soon. Things like tunnel screen, you need. You still need a little bit of time to pass. So those kind of frighten me. Because I feel like those are better when you're actually doing well on offense and defense is over pursuing. Something that might be good here, I think I'm going to try to run some blitzing with Ben Jacobs, run, and I'll run uh, Ben Jacobs manually. So we'll just blitz the one guy. Technically, it's a four-man rush. We'll play Jacob. We'll play Ben Jacobs here and see if we can get a pick. See if we can get him to throw it to us. Goodness. Perfect read. We also didn't get much pass rush, right? Oh, we actually did okay. I mean, the pass rush wasn't bad. Unfortunately, our guy got turned down. Hmm. So let's do... Uh, you know, let's, let's come at him a bit. Let's see, how does this look? I'll manual up on this, on this guy right here. And of course, we get no pressure. We blitz two guys. They all bite on the running back. How convenient. Yeah, we definitely can. They've been moving them around too, though, so I don't know if that's necessarily the way to go. Like, I don't know if it, we, I wouldn't bank on it being a great move. Because we also have, like, I wouldn't bank on it working exactly. Concentrating. Oh, I got the great jump and everything. There he goes. Oh. Tried to get the big hit. Yeah, yeah, we definitely could do that. But also, I'm, I'm comfortable with Bennett. I'm just as comfortable throwing to Bennett as Wiley. So let's do this. Let's try to call blitzes and then audible out, see if that helps at all. So, okay, of course, they don't show me the audible screen, so I don't know what I'm calling. Goodness. I'll play Skinner. Can cheat up a bit. Oh, here we go. Of course. Of course, he's just stiff arming my stud linebackers. Ah, man. Of all the times I want to gain this, let's try it again, though. I mean, I want to do this and then audible, and I can't see it. Why can't I see the audibles? I can't see the plays, man. I think it's L, though. God, that's garbage. Here we go. Of course, I can't get up there. Oh, we had that, man. We actually got my hands on it. Just the fingertips, though. Okay, so that's good. Uh, we'll do that again, I guess. I'll run. So here, I'm going to do this. L. Yeah, that's our cover three. Let's spy him. We'll play McDonald up the back here. No. Nope. Wow, I didn't expect... Oh, okay, so here. I didn't expect him to throw that fast. They pretty much never do that. Because I plan on getting back. They never throw that fast. So I got burned. But see, that's when they get you. When they do something that you don't expect at all, that's when they get you. <laughs> How did I get knocked back? I oh, wasn't that right there for the, the kick block? Or uh, what was that about? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. So I blow him back, and I go for the kick. Oh, then I get decleated. Perfect rotation by the guard. Boom. Okay. Well, I don't want to give up on the run yet. I mean, I just, I need to get a touchdown drive. I don't need to, I don't think I necessarily need to think big play because I feel like that's too much all or nothing. I want to bring that out, but I know I shouldn't. It, it was never good. I don't, it was never straight ways. Yeah, missed field goal means 21 points for them. That's pretty much how it went, though. I missed a field goal, they got a little momentum, and then it was just a dumpster fire after that. Yes. Look at that. Look at that, Robbie. Let's go. Okay, let's get out. Whew. We needed that. We needed that. Yeah, I missed the field goal, and then... Uh, 
And then what? They scored a touchdown. Then I had a play where I was trying to throw the ball away. And instead of throwing it away, Carr tucked it and ended up fumbling. It was the dumbest thing ever. It made me mad because I was trying to throw the ball away. But for some reason, he went tuck rule on me. Yes, there we go. He went tuck rule and he fumbled it. They ran it back for a touchdown. Chris Carter is out. He has a torn quad, which to me sounds like it's merciful that he's only out for five weeks. Yeah, it's been a snowball. I still have a chance, though. This is not out of hand by any stretch. Like, it's still within reach here. Set up in the gun. Car, back to pass. Complete. Let's have to feed our man. Wow, that's cheap as hell. So what, is, what happens here? He jumps, he hurdles, and then still gets caught. I've never seen that. Third and one. Not really sure what to do here. Let's go slot whips. Let's see. This kind of looks like man. Can't really tell. There we go. Yes, Robbie. Robbie's the freaking man. There's no no discussion. He's the man. Okay, we'll go. Uh, we'll go. Since Robbie's out, we'll go old faithful. I wish, man. That question was asked. <laughs> this is a valid one. That's pretty good. For Lawrence, we'll take it. Considering we get no pass blocking, I'll take a two-yard run. I have no issues with that. So let's do let's do QB slot. We'll run with Lawrence. Okay, he's got some potential off the right side here. Like I said, I can't, I can't be in a rush yet. You know, two minutes left in the fourth. Yes, third quarter. No. Okay, let's just get him. Get a few. Okay, that's good. About two yards on the run. So here, let's go back to corner sit. I really like corner sit here. I don't care for Robbie being out, but hey, that's 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 how it goes. He uh, we ran him pretty hard. Kind of want to hit Doug, or Bennett here. Actually, let's see though. Let's go to Lawrence. Oh no, bad pass. Wobbler in the dirt, and Bennett wouldn't have been open. So Dudley actually kind of was getting open here. But this, even though this looks super good, it's not nearly as good as it looks because there's not much real estate to work with. Now, if that's a streak, that's one thing, but it's a corner, so that's actually not as good as it looks. Uh, we're gonna have to go for it here. Uh, let's see, what do we wanna run? I'm thinking actually split and drag. Yeah, let's run split and drag. And let's run it with, uh, let's run it here so I can get same side uh, running back and uh, corner. No, you know what? We'll run it opposite side. Yeah, we need this. We need this. No, I don't like mech's protection here. I'll explain why. Actually, Leonard looks pretty good here, so let's see what we get. Get there. Get upfield. Yes. Yeah, with, with Derek Carr's accuracy is not looking good, so Max protection is not really that useful. Okay, let's see. Robbie's still out. I wouldn't mind if he came back. Yeah, I mean, Derek Carr just threw a swing pass in the dirt, so I don't really want to run max protect. Not on fourth down, at least. Oh, I got baptized. Dang it, I was doing manual counter, but their rush got upfield. Their rush got in there. So my right guard just blocked nobody. He was going for third level. Okay, let's do... What do we got here? Let's run double cross. This is actually a pretty good play. I should run it more often. Bennett, Dudley, so we have a nice combo here. Okay, looks like man, actually. So here, Leonard might be the guy to go to. Let's see if we can block, uh, can we block Lawrence. We've got two shots at this. Third shot, got it. So I kind of, I want to go Leonard here. Oh, he's not there. Darn it. Uh, gosh, darn it. Nope, not there. Yeah, so I was hoping this would be man. Oh, and it was. Okay. He really didn't have position, though, either. So really kind of nobody effectively open there. Third and 13. This is tough. Let's go with this inside hook. So if this is zone, I can try to lob one up to Bennett. I mean, six foot five. And if it's man, we'll hit Dudley coming in, hopefully. If they blitz a lot, I could go Leonard, try to set up for a closer fourth down. Okay. Bennett. Nope, and it's a hit on the throw. I had no protection. 
I guess I kind of ran out too. I kind of ran myself into a sack. That's too bad. Yeah, but Bennett, Bennett's open here. He cuts. I can cut in front and try to sky it. That's not as bad as it looks because I can cut in front. The pressure definitely got to the quarterback there because that pass was not. Well, let's just see. We can play Bennett over break, and then when, if if slash when we get the ball back, we need to. Uh, we need to uh, be more aggressive trying to get the ball downfield. Don't really have time to try to uh, to try to uh, run the ball anymore. Nice, nice tackle, Slade Powell. From their own 39-yard line, it's second and seven. The linebackers shift a bit inside. Drops back to pass. Steps up there he goes. He takes off. He's hit and got away. Wow. Their QB was bowling balling people. And a big gain on a quarterback scramble. Easy play there. The receivers run to the We could try 5-2 here. Not really much of a fan of it, but, you know, if it messes up their pass protection or anything, then we've got to go for it. So we'll take Travis Brown. Yeah, this will be quite a comeback if we can pull it off, but... It's doable. Can't give up hope. Uh, let's go with Crash 3 now, since they're kind of changing up their look. Let's see. I like Blitz on that side. We'll move Skinner over. We'll get in there. Yes! Okay, that's what we needed. That's what I was hoping for. That is what I was hoping for. Yep, they didn't have anybody to cover that. They're running back. I'm thinking, you see the running back do nothing. I'm thinking he's in a delay, so he's actually not really pass blocking. He seems to start to go out. Wow, we needed that badly. Three wide, so let's go back here. We'll call the Thunder Green and we'll audible out to cover three at the last moment. Arizona State comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. Oh, we needed that. I tried to pick it. Oh man, we tried. We were there though. We were there, that's good. So here, let's go. Ah oh, man. Let's go cover three again. Crash three. So we're blitzing a guy. Okay, I'm going to manual Skinner because I need to also look for the QB to run here. Oh, okay, we boxed. Oh, man, I was really afraid of a uh, – I was deathly afraid of a uh, of it pass interference there because I came up and looked too. I actually hit him before I go into an animation. That probably should have been pass interference. And if honestly, if, I, if I'm Arizona State, I'm pretty mad that I didn't get a PI right there. Because I was thinking I got the animation before hitting, but I actually hit him first, so I got super lucky there. So let's see what we can work out. We're going with, uh, actually, let's, we got those two guys. We'll get Skinner back. I don't think we'll be able to return this. Yeah, we got to let that go. It's okay, so not really the end of the world yet. We'll go split and drag. Let's just see what we can get. We need to see if we can get stuff going downfield. Let's block Rouse. Probably not going Wiley here. Also, depending on what that middle safety does, if Bennett looks like he's alone, even in zone, I'll, against zone, I'll, I'll throw it. Here we go. Leonard. Oh, we got it. Look at Leonard making plays, man. Leonard. Do we have 93 yards of offense? Is that really what that said, or is that passing? Okay, we have 192. But yeah, we had passing yards is horrible. We're just really not getting time to throw. Okay, let's have a look. I'm liking this play here. We can check this out. Double cross. So let's 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 pay attention here. We had Dudley get super loose. Near side. It was near side, but he did get super loose. He might be getting it again here. And it was kind of a pick type of situation. So their safety came up, so let's go to it. Oh no! Oh, I got picked. Look at me. Boom. Oh man. Of course, that's probably more overthrown. Oh, dude, we got—we'll have to keep that one more, uh, more in the in the side pocket, though. We got to remember that play. That's a good one. Yeah, I mean, it's true, but I mean, I, I like my other receivers, and I'd rather not. I don't think I should be like trying to focus on. I'm actually going to block here, so we're looking at Dudley or Leonard here. Leonard. Oh, that's a pick. Wow, what a terrible throw. No air on it. This is disappointing because 
Carr's been throwing this route pretty well, but look, this is just there's no there's nothing on this. Carr's is having a terrible game. I think it's it's Featherstein, man. We got to take him out. So if we can, yeah, he's his passes are just total total butt right now. So let's see what we can work out. So let's see, six points. I'm trying to think if we can like if they score. Actually, I'm actually gonna let Jacob. I'll come down. I'll mangle Jacobs here. Yes, that's what we needed. That's what we needed. Still in this thing. Okay, so we're going with feathers. Let's go to let's go to PA read flow because this is good with him rolling out to the right, and he can also make throws too. Okay, they shift a bit. That's cool. So we'll go, we're going to roll out right with Feathers. Maybe hit Leonard. Okay, we're going to just take off running here. Nice. Have I turned over seven times? I'm not surprised. What is that, four picks or something like that? One quarter sit. Yeah, they don't even have that much offense. But also, only on, I think, one of the... Uh, Turnovers have I really gotten burned. So we're going to pay extra attention to Dudley here. He's been getting a little bit loose. We'll go Rouse, actually. Okay, pretty good pass, actually, there. Feathers is looking pretty good. Okay, now I want to go back to... I want to go back to double cross. Okay, Wiley. Leonard could get loose here. If this is man, I kind of want to go Leonard. He's on a he's on a linebacker. Give me some kind of movement, poor Favre. Or not. Ooh, Bennett. Wow, terrible pass. Oh, no! Oh, we got it back. Not a good pass here. Doesn't lead him at all. He actually has to come back. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. We were getting lucky here. Let's go split and drag. He... I went... I bench Carter. I don't... No, I don't know what they're talking about. Let's go, Robbie. Rolls right, dumps it. Wow, couldn't hit him. I also feel like Robbie didn't really try to get that. He reaches back. That's bizarre. I had Dudley. Dudley's open in the middle. Not completely. I mean, these guys can easily run faster than this beating bullet, but uh, that's that's too bad we missed that one. Let's go Old Faithful again. We had great luck last time. From the 29-yard line. See, this is so much of me not converting when I get down here. Because the funny thing is, we haven't gotten burned on the uh, on the, those turnovers that badly. Ah, nothing. What? He just re this guy releases, man. Well, it's okay. Let's go. Let's go split and drag. Coming like this. So the post has been open. So we can look for Leonard here. Let's block Robbie. And here, Dudley, I have faith that Dudley can curl if we need him to. Yeah, we're going to need it. Yes! Oh, no. And we lost the first down. Dude, this is such an NCAA game, man. My goodness. We're going slot whips. This is what I like to run here in, uh, in this situation. So rather than look for Wiley, though, we're probably going to have to look for uh, for for Bennett if it's man. Nope, we're going Wiley. Yes! <laughs> oh, we got an injury, so we can't run hurry up. This is just, we're getting it from every angle right now, you guys. Every possible angle. This is Max NCA right now. This is Max. Let's see how they shift here. Moving over. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get in. Okay. Okay. So do I go for two now? I guess like do I go for two now? I guess I should, right? Yeah. So the offense will stay on the field and attempt the two-point conversion. Okay, should I? Sh I might just run this. Yeah, I think that I'm running it with Rouse here. I'll read it though. Oh no, no. 
This guy kind of, he does it. Look at this shimmy in. That's, that totally throws me off. He shimmies in. He goes in and then up. Usually they just run up, man. Bad read on my part. Well, so we still have five minutes left. It's not insurmountable. Yeah, that's bad. That was bad, though. It's not insurmountable, though. Okay, brought it out. It's a chance to force a fumble. Wow. So the offense takes over. Okay, they still have full momentum. I mean, this is this would be the mother of comebacks if I can pull this off. So don't get your hopes up, but we'll see. Spencer out for three weeks. That's my left tackle. Arizona State lines up with three receivers. See if we get another pick here. Oh, here we go. And now he's going to run. And he's tackled at the 42. That is exactly why this I mean, I guess I don't know if I need to run a spy or what. It's first and 10. Glass alone in the backfield. First down, looking to throw. Steps up. Anderson lets it go. Okay, here we go. Go oh, backwards. Oh, no. What is this? What are these guys doing? Look how they just run backwards. They mirror him. Look at Ben Jacobs. He doesn't go. He just like runs backwards. Gosh, that's frustrating. Four wide. Right, maybe I need to get off the 3 3 5 split. That's very possible. The backers looking for something up the middle. Anderson off the face. Oh! Dude. Okay, he went for the tip. I pushed Y. Oh, I wasn't controlling him. It didn't change my guy. You gotta be or maybe I mistook the dot as him, me being on him. I might have mistaken that. That'll make it second down. Drops back to pass. Steps up. Looks. He delivers. Oh! Golly! Nobody, huh? I even thought he might throw there. Look at me. I'm trying to bat it down. I'm trying to pick it. I missed the pick. Missed the pick. Miss. Well, I don't know if that's a miss. He doesn't. He whiffs it. No, that's a miss. And a miss. Four missed picks in one play. Is that a record? Is that a record? I think that might be a record. So here I'm going to go. I'm going to do this, and I have to. I have to spy. I have to spy. Anderson, back to throw. Moves up in the pocket. Oh, no. My God. He went for the freaking pick. It didn't, I tried to select the guy, too, and it wouldn't let me. I pushed B, and it wouldn't get... Because, look, look I, I, tried to, I tried to do a move with, with Jacobs because it didn't... So, I need three scores. Oh, they're going for a... Uh, I guess I'll just stick with this. Wow. I didn't expect him to go for two. So we're only down 17, guys. Yeah, that was a strange one. Hey, no fumble there. We'll settle for no fumble. Uh, let's go Old Faithful. Feathers has been running it pretty well. Okay, that's a scary shift, but we'll get him off of it with Dudley here. Number 12 has four receivers lined up here. Goodness. Actually, let's do this. And he drops it. Well, I still like, I mean, that's the right way to go. In my opinion. Let's stay with the spread look. We'll go double cross. No big deal. Watch. They'll go to him again, and he'll come up with the catch. You know, he probably will, but there's still no excuse for the one he just dropped. Back to back. Looking. He fired. Goodness. Another drop. I mean, my guys are getting destroyed, though, so, I mean, I can't be too mad about the drops, I guess, because they're getting just demolished out there. Uh, I guess we're on split and drag. So here we just have to really cross our fingers that if it's zone, we can hit Dudley on post. Number 12, back in the gun. Back to 
So here we go. Sky me. Nice. Brothers with the tackle at the 40 yard. Yeah, it's true. You just had to kind of. You, you can't like you can't anticipate certain things. It's really true. Oh gosh, darn it! Did I have anybody? Kind of wily, like right off the bat, but otherwise not really. Let's go back to double cross. This is a pretty nice play. Okay, this could be a zone look. If it's zone, yeah, let's walk Rouse. We're just going to kind of hope Dudley can get, get loose on his own and kind of sky out and uh, jump up on a corner out. Oh, gosh darn it. it th there's something wrong with my controller because I, I tried to select him like earlier and it didn't give it to me. What a bummer. Let's go Old Faithful. And here I guess if I have it, I'll run if it's open. See what they do. Okay, we'll fan the line right. I actually might want to run here. Okay, they blitz like everybody. Of course they do. Of course they do. Okay, let's see what we can get here. So fourth and thirteen. So I actually want to go back to the uh, double cross here because that's actually been it's been pretty open. So here it's pretty much looking like Dudley or maybe Leonard. Probably more Dudley though. Or even Wiley. Actually, if it's a post, I think we're looking, or if it's a zone, we're looking Wiley. Yeah, we're going to have to go Wiley here. Get it in there. Yeah. Oh, damn it. That was a read too. I mean, that's that was the best, that was the best chance. Yep. It's kind of another cow going on. More turnovers, though. Soul man up the receiver here. They could try to pop deep. The computer does like doing that. Nope. Okay, we'll go to... Uh, let's see. So if we can hold him a field goal, it actually doesn't change the three-score thing. And I realize this is basically over. I do realize that. Don't get me wrong. So let's just do a spy here. Arizona State comes out with an eye formation. Justice gets on the inside. Jacob tackles him at the 21. That run didn't go far. They'll spot the ball a yard from the line of scrimmage. They line up at the 21. Yeah, if, if we stop them here, I'll call the timeout. They could be passing it here. I'm going to flip this so that guys are lined up properly. We'll man up over here. Oh, I thought it was third down for some reason. We'll still we'll call timeouts after this. Give to the tailback. He jukes. McDonald with a takedown at the 15-yard line. Fresno State will call a timeout. All out blitz. Here we go. So third down, they could be. We'll, we'll actually we'll blitz McDonald as well. They actually could be throwing it here. Yep, they are. And of course, no play on the ball. We're there. Just let him go. Let him go. Let him go, and no pass rush. Nothing. Is it even three scores? Isn't it four? I guess if we block this, it could be three scores still. Oh no, wait. No, I guess it's three TDs and and uh, two pointers. <sighs> There's the computer though. They're clairvoyant, man. They have that locked in. Like if I called a regular D, they would just run it. Yeah, this is full NCA, and it's pretty. I have to run this out just in case I can make something happen. 
It's but it's been yeah, it's been full on NCA with the uh, a lot of it, yeah, because of that missed uh, that missed field goal. Here's the offensive production statistics sponsored by Coca-Cola. Arizona State comes out defensively with six defensive backs. He looks oh. okay, but it actually came and got it. Edward tackles him at the 29. There you have it, folks. Your Coca-Cola. Uh, we're not ready to play the game yet. Really earned it out there today. The Bulldog with four receivers. He's looking. Rolls right. He throws it. Picked off. Picked off, of course. Of course, my guy can't reach. It's like he stops. Why would he do that? And they come up with yeah, I know. No, it's just been that kind of game. Oh, rated chance, dude. We're getting, we're getting, they're, they're laying into us, man. The ASU crowd is merciless. So actually, let's just get our guys out, too. I might even call my last time out. I don't want guys to get hurt. Yeah, that's been a rough one. Yeah, that's how it goes, man. That's NCA. I mean, how many teams do I beat doing the same thing? I win all the time. Because I get momentum and I just I choke him out on the mat. That's how this game goes. And my whole the whole setup of this game, the way I have it set up, is because I want to get momentum and then try to choke him out. But I also want it to be hard. I don't want it to be a total pushover. I just really hope I can beat USC. Like my desire to beat USC is probably more now than it ever will be. Like even if we were undefeated at the time. I just really have to prove that, because I know I can win these kind of games. I know I can. Let's see if we can get. Oh, I have a timeout actually. Oh, it doesn't matter though. I can't make him punt it. They could be going to the right out. He's in the zone. Is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Yeah. Oh. yeah, it's crazy. So one thing that seems super consistent with momentum is when you're going against a good secondary, you basically can't really, you can't really complete passes. <laughs> At least I don't have good enough receivers for that. I don't have good enough receivers to uh, to withstand the hits that you have to take. I mean, should I have been going to Hayden instead? Trying to get Hayden open because he's a bigger, stronger guy? I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's a tough one. Two losses. Two out of three losing after uh, after winning 34 in a row. Hey, that's NCAA, baby. That's what I imagine Scotty Wynn would say if, if he was if he was watching. Talk about such a good season that is like off the rails. We were having a pretty or a really good season. Sketchy as some things were. So we ran it, we actually ran it 33 times, but I bet a bunch of those had to be sacks, right? Five sacks. So we're also doing pretty good, but like my passing was so bad. I don't think I could like if I ran if I say I only ran and didn't pass, I would it would have I wouldn't have had a good result, I don't think. Maybe a little better, but they probably still would have ran away with it. Two seventy two offense, just god awful passing. Four fifteen on third. Four turnovers. They had four turnovers as well. That's funny. Receiving. So how many drops do we end up with? Seven drops. Yeah, my passing stats are much better if those don't get dropped. Freaking rough. But that's how I have this this set up, as I said. If it's wait, Jacobs is hurt? They said today's key injuries. I didn't notice that. Did you notice that? I didn't notice that before, I should say. Yeah, I'll save it. Yeah, so th this is how I have it set up. So I mean it, it the game should be super hard against a top team with momentum. It should be it should be really really hard to overcome that, and it was. Gosh, we got close though. We got really close. 
when I scored a touchdown, because when did I, let's see, what was the, I don't have it on here, but I scored that touchdown with Feathers, and then they immediately came back and scored a TD. When I scored that touchdown with Feathers, I think I was only down one score at that point. Oh, man, that's rough. So wait, did, did Jacobs get hurt? I swear he was out there when I subbed out. Yeah, so I don't know what that was about. I don't know why he was listed under injuries. Okay. Yeah, it was... And it was like mid-third quarter, I mean, or two minutes left in the third. It was a good drive. I had an excellent scoring drive. Yeah, and I was hoping to make it seven right by going for two. Right, and I didn't get that. Right, there you go. Yeah. Five, okay, in the fourth? I thought it was the third, but yeah, I guess it was. Right, because the six-pointer was in the third, yeah. So let's see our, our recruiting. We still got these guys coming. He wants to play for a big-time coach, Coach Prestige. And this gentleman here wants to be part of our football tradition, Program Prestige. So we still have some hope on here. Gosh, I, I have to beat USC. I have to beat these guys just to show, and it's at home, so that makes it easier, just to show that I can... I can beat one of these A-plus teams, man. I have to get it done. Oh, did they? I didn't see. Look at that. They lost, and they're number four now. Did I not advance the week? I did advance the week. Who'd they lose to? Who'd they lose to to where they're only number four? They lost USC. <laughs> Talk about a love triangle in the Pac-10 over here. Fresno State, Arizona State, USC all beating each other. Hopefully we can complete the triangle and beat USC. So how funny would that be if I end up ranked higher than, well, eh, I guess if I beat USC, I'll be ranked higher than them, but not Cal. Wowzers. What's What are the rankings looking like then? OU West Virginia. So West Virginia is looking for a revenge tour. All right. Wow, that's another tough one. That's a tough one. I'm not really sure what I would have done differently. I mean, I, strategically, I don't know what I would have done differently. As far as execution, certainly I want to make that that field goal. That's about all I can think of. Strategy-wise, I played the running game as long as I could. Because also up until that field goal, I was playing a good game. I had momentum, I had a six-point lead. I was playing good defense. Uh, but yeah, I, I can't really say, I, I'm welcome to, uh, I'm open to suggestions though, if you guys think I should have done something strategically differently. I, I definitely, I could have tried to move Wiley out of, move him around a bit and try to get the ball to him. But nobody was making plays, it wasn't just him, it wasn't like, I, I don't know. I, I trust, I trust Bennett almost as much. He's not as much of a playmaker, but to catch a pass, especially because he's 6'5", I almost trust him more if their secondary is all a bunch of uh, a bunch of hard hitters and juiced up on momentum. So, wow, yeah, another tough game, but hey, this is how it goes. We've got to try to rebound. And I said, I said the whole time during that win streak, like, hey, this is not normal. This is not normal. This will come to an end, and it has definitely come to an end. It has come to an end. It fell off a cliff. But hey, we're still having a 9-2 season. We're ranked number 13. If we could beat USC, we could potentially still get a BCS Bowl. What do we? What do they have us slated for right now? Probably like, uh, what is it? Holiday Bowl? Insight.com. Notre Dame. That'd be a good one, actually. An A against Notre Dame. That'd be cool. We're getting sanctioned anyway. Yeah, so it's going to be, it's almost like a rebuild. This is almost rebuild time. You know, that, you know that rebuild that you usually do after you win the natty? That's what we're, that's what we're looking at. <laughs> oh, man. So I'm going to end the video there. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time, most likely Wednesday, with USC. We need some revenge. We can beat these guys. And also, it's, all, it's at home. We can audible hot route better. So I think we can pull it off. I think we can pull it off. So we'll see you guys then. Yeah, exactly, right? Absolutely. Send them off like the Marlins. Ha, ha, ha.